It's your Feel Good Breakfast Show. We are live in SABC3. This is Expresso and so much excitement here. We've got Prime Circle. We've got the best recipes. And that is the best recipe to hand over to this next group. These guys are dancers for our Friday dance. And from humble beginnings to the world stage, Exo Empire has taken the world by storm. I'm telling you, from Amsterdam to the United States of America, Exo Empire has truly represented South Africa in the best way possible. And today, we are joined by two of our amazing guests, Jamie. Yes, yes, we are we sitting do. down with head coach and choreographer Craig Gilly, as well as assistant coach and choreographer as well, Jade Adams. A very good morning to both of you and welcome to your Feel Good, good Breakfast morning. Show. Thank so you. So good to have dancers with us because maybe you can teach us, I don't know if you saw our salsa, we were a hot mess and we're going to take all the steps because you guys are international. <laughs> Before we get into all the accolades, how have you guys been? I mean, it's been a very tough time for so many artists, especially for dance groups uh, yes. during lockdown. How have you been and how has being, dealing with that been for you guys? So it's been a quite tough journey. I mean, we've been prepping last year for competition, just a year that our competitions are all cancelled. So obviously our spirits are all low and it's been a tough one, but right now we are prepping for new competitions. Um, yeah, you can speak about what we did during lockdown and how we handled the situation <laughs> over there. So, so <laughs> you, you know. Okay, so basically we did online classes basically. And it wasn't really much to do, first of all, but I mean, once we hit to level three, we jumped, took the opportunity to jump into practice, yeah. So, That's yeah. great. I mean, you guys have competed on a, a national level. I mean, you represented South yes. Africa and you went to Amsterdam for this and a couple of other so, tournaments. I know you can represent in cricket and football <laughs> and a lot of other things, but to represent on a dance level for South Africa, how did that feel? Wow. Let's just say wow. Mm. Absolutely amazing experience. I'll speak mostly about Arizona Phoenix. Yeah, yeah. So we went up against 50 different countries, guys. What? Wow. 55-0. So it is quite tough, but what I can say, the experience was absolutely amazing. We took a lot out of it. We grew as a crew. And I think that's evident in our dancing. You'll see that later on. Mm. Um, I think our mindset is way different now. We child more as a crew. And I feel like if we were to do Worlds next time, we'd make it much, we all place much better, basically. But it I, is a good experience. Wow. I love that confidence. Like, when we do, when we do well, yes. we are going to bring yes, it. Yes, we'll be there. <laughs> and I believe also you guys are champs um, in this, and you guys uh, are represent, represented as a mega crew. For those people who don't know what a mega crew is, maybe you can mm. fill us in on that. <laughs> okay, so in the Dodgy industry with competitions, you have different sections. You get from your cadet, your juniors, your varsity, your adult, and mega crew. Mega crew consists of... 15 to 40 dancers on the stage, and that is basically why I call mega crew because it's like it's you and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, that's just basically it. But how difficult is it to be able? Because I mean, with five people teaching five people a dance routine, as you can see, it's very, very difficult. <laughs> Doing it with 50 people or 40 people, everyone has to be in sync, mm -hmm. everyone has to know timing, beats, all of that. How much preparation goes into preparing yourself for worlds? Uh, it's a lot. It's a lot, it's a lot. <laughs> we had late practices, we had early morning practices, we practiced on public holidays, and we just took every opportunity we could get to practice just to be perfect, especially for SA Champs at the moment. We are now um, going forward to SA Champs, um, to that national competition. It took a lot out of us as a crew. I mean, most of our dancers in more than one section, like three, four sections. So for them, it was like a whole day dancing. They would dance now, take a break, they must do another routine, they take a break. So it was a lot. I think overseas our practices were the worst. Okay. Was we'd practice during the day, we'd get to rest like two hours, then 12 a.m. practice again, finishing off at 3 a.m., practice again at 6 a.m. till 8. It was tough, mm. but it was needed, you know? I mean, you're going up against world-class crews, mm. so it was needed. Okay, well, you know what? You guys are going to show us some stuff now. I know you shot a music video recently, and I'm sure we can uh, low-key flex that later, but for now, I'm excited. Yes, we have to. We have to flex something. So we, we'd love to see exactly what you guys are capable of, especially as a crew. So a little later, EXO Empire on Expresso. They've been everywhere in the world, but this is going to be the show that you are going to, you know, you're going to proper coy something new, yes. all right? Shoulders and yes. all of those pop lock things. Kind of wait. They'll be on your Feel Good Breakfast show a little later. EXO Empire, look out for them.